Hi, I'm Cole with your WCCO at the State Fair newscast. We begin today's coverage with uh, news from the Haunted House. WCCO anchors Frank and Chris went in this morning, but they haven't came out yet. That's a sad story. Witnesses, witnesses who saw them enter said they looked ready for anything, not scared it. In the least, that was four hours ago. That's a sad story. A search party went in 30 minutes ago. Reports say that they can hear Frank and Chris screams, but they, they haven't been able to track them and down yet. A mummy from the second floor says he saw the pair about an hour ago. He said they jumped and screamed and raised out before he could grab one of them. This is a developing the story. We'll keep you updated on the search. Let's check in on weather and traffic. Hello, my name is Fiona with your weather and traffic updates. It is a beautiful day at the fair and officials say they are expecting record numbers of people on the streets. Record numbers, you hear that? Yeah. <laughs> we are beginning to see backups on Judson Avenue by the Miracle of Birth Center where I was earlier today, where Ashley the cow is expected to give birth at any moment. Things are getting congested on Cooper Street right outside of the Lumberjack Show. We're hearing reports of a family of four weaving in and out of traffic. Apparently, they heard how delicious the deep fried grilled cheese bites were. And they just couldn't wait to try some. <laughs> As for this beautiful weather, and it has been beautiful out there, it's expected to hold right through the week. Back to you. This just in, WCCO anchors for Inc. and Chris have been found. Searchers found them on the third floor, hiding behind a coffin. They are tired, thirsty, and still a little shaken after a long ordeal, but are expected to be okay. I'm Cole. And I'm Fiona. Thank you for watching WCCO at the State Fair Newscast.